SMART is a criteria we use to ensure that our goals meet the quality standards necessary to achieve results. SMART means that all goals should be specific, measurable, attainable, relevant, and time-bound. Goals that do not meet the SMART criteria may lack focus or may not be tied to a realistic and rigorous timeline. If we do not adhere to this model, it is likely that our goals will not be efficient in helping us achieve our overall vision. Whenever we do set a goal, we should use the trend data that we have collected through the monitoring of our shared vision and our code of cooperation to set a goal that fits the SMART criteria. Our goal must be specific, meaning we clearly state exactly what we want to accomplish. This system works because the learners are able to create a specific goal based off of what they feel that they, that they need help on to become a better citizen. And how are we going to meet this goal? What are you going to do? You face forward. Okay, so we're going to meet this goal by facing. Good. Forward. Where? In the carpet. At the carpet. That's where we're having a lot of trouble with, so good. It should be measurable. We should be able to clearly track whether our goal has been met or not. So we're going to check at the end of the day if we made our goal. And we're going to check at the end of this week to see how many times we met our goal to see if our goal was measurable and if we were able to meet our goal. Okay? It should be attainable. We should not set goals that are impossible to reach, but at the same time, they should be rigorous enough that they present a challenge. We use our trend data to set a attainable goal for the learners based off of data that we've seen in the past. Yesterday, we got an orange. So what is your new goal going to be today? What do you think we should try? Maybe three level three, so that, that way we can meet our goal. So my goal is to get, how many three. did you say? Three. Level. level. Three. Three. Our goal should be relevant, meaning it is tied directly to the shared vision or our code of cooperation that we have created together. It should be something that we feel strongly about. The learners understand that their goals are relevant to their learning because their goals are tied directly from our shared vision and our code of cooperation that we've created as a class. Why are we working on this goal? Why is it important for us to face forward? To pay attention and listen. Pay attention and listen, so our brains can grow. Ah. It should also be time bound, meaning we should always have a specific timeline for meeting our goals. When are we gonna check this goal? After what? Writing. After writing? Mastery. And after? Math. math today, after math. So let's, let's go ahead and read our goal. Can you point and let's read it? My goal is to Get three level three by, by facing forward. Good, keep reading. At the carpet. At the carpet. So that's our new goal today. Do you think we can meet our goal today? Yes? Give me a high five. So check yourself today, okay? So we can meet our goal. You want to take this to yourself? After creating our goal and ensuring that it fits the SMART model, we will build an action plan around it. It is important that we periodically check ourselves to make sure our plan has us on the right track to achieve our goal. We must then be able to adjust our goal when problems arrive to ensure that we stay on target. 